Hey guys, it's Tuesday. You know what that means? It is Two Minute Tuesday. And by the way, I know there was a rumor saying we're not going to do Two Minute Tuesday today, but we are, and we're going to get started right now. This morning, I had such a unique dream um, from the Lord. One was a word for a friend of mine that was related to the second part of this dream. The second part of this dream, uh, I saw a, a man digging a tunnel underground. He was at this one point and just kept digging and couldn't get past this one area. It was almost like those rocks that were stopping him from going past. And then at some point, uh, he started seeing this dream. It was the dream of God. And from, it was almost like a map because once he saw this dream, he could see the tunnel beyond the point that he was stopping at. And as he kept digging from this point on, the rocks and everything that was in ahead of him uh, was starting to fall and he was able to expand so much. The first part of the street, was I saw a friend of mine, above him was the word hope dealer and was the farthest thing from being a hope dealer just because he was so discouraged by what was happening in life. What the Lord was saying was, if he could spend time with the Lord and allow the Lord to show the dream that the Lord had for him, especially in the areas of disappointment, in the areas where he was lacking hope, he would be refreshed and he would start to see bigger than what he could see. If you're fighting hopelessness, if you're fighting discouragement, start to dream the dream of God in your life. And how do you do that? You spend some time with the Lord and you say, Lord, in this area of my life where I'm fighting hopelessness, discouragement, what is the dream that you have for me? What is the dream that you have in this area of my life? You may be saying, dude, that sounds so trippy. It sounds weird. What is God's dream? Well, here's the thing. Everything that happens on the earth has first happened in the mind of God. Even you, before you were born. The Bible says, before you were formed, I knew you. Now, God knew you before you were physically formed. But where did that happen? It happened in the mind and in the heart of God. And he's waiting for you to come in agreement with it and start to see what would happen on the earth when the dream of God is fulfilled. When the dream of God starts to happen, hope flourishes. Book of Proverbs says, hope deferred makes the heart sick. But a dream fulfilled is the spring of life. Let the Lord start to invite you into His dream that you would dream with the Lord together. Guys, this is Two Minute Tuesday. I hope it encouraged you. If it did, do me a favor. Like and share this. And tag someone. I hope this would help them as well. Until the next Two Minute Tuesday, talk to you later.